Team Lick It, I'm Romy, and today I'll be your host for the Lick It Games. The ponies will compete in a series of challenges, and the pony who comes out on top will win the ultimate prize, a pile of Lick It snacks. Let's meet our first contestant. This is Trixie. She's my Welsh Cross Cop, and I've owned her for two years. We love to compete, and we've competed in every discipline, up to 80 centimeters. Unfortunately, in May, she sustained an injury, which had to be treated surgically, but she is now on track to make a full recovery. Let's meet our second contestant. This is Dylan. He's an awesome competition pony who I'm lucky enough to be racing whilst Trixie is out of work. He's actually 23 years old, believe it or not, but, he kept, but he's been competing well into his older age. Let's see what he has to offer. Our first challenge was minute to lick it. The ponies had one minute to lick this apple lick it as many times as they possibly could. As you can see, Dylan's approach was a bit more steady, so Trixie ended up being victorious for this round with around 81 licks per minute. The next game was break the bag. A bag full of lick it snacks and carrots was placed folded in front of the ponies and whichever pony could most efficiently get to the food was our winner. <laughs> As you can see, Dylan's method was much more practical and he managed to be eating in absolutely no time. So in our books, Dylan took home the win on this one. The final challenge was Lick It Pickup. A trail of mint and eucalyptus snacks were laid out and Dylan and Trixie had to try and reach the end as quickly as possible. And Trixie just took the win, literally, by a nose. So Miss Trixie was the winner of the first Lick It Games, but both ponies played very well and were great competitors, and I'm sure they also enjoyed all the tasty treats we gave them. So that's the end of this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it was probably quite different from what you usually get, but I thought I would give it a go. Thank you so much for watching.